Hey guys, this is Luke from the Crossroads Inn, and welcome to another Warcraft lore video. In this video, I'll be talking about the lore of death, Bum Samdi, and basically everything about it. Anyway, just sit back and enjoy another tale from the Crossroads. Loa is the name given by trolls to the beings that they worship, such as the wild gods, who are primal manifestations of life and nature, spirits like wisps, and Gahun, who is an old god worshipped by the blood trolls of Nazmir, as a Loa. Powerful and light and Zandalari can become Loa upon their death, or so it is believed. Vun Samdi is a very powerful Loa that controls the spirits of the dead, primarily trolls, and all spirits of trolls on Zandalar go to him upon death. He grows more powerful with more souls in his care. The Zandalari pray to him and through their rituals, Bumsamdi answers them either in kind or curses them with pain depending on his mood. His origins are unknown and while he appears as a troll, Bumsamdi himself stated that he came before the trolls. When the Dark Spear trolls were driven from the Echo Isles by a powerful witch doctor Zelazane who betrayed them, Vol'jin managed to recruit Bumsamdi to his side after he and his warriors proved themselves worthy. The Loa of Death helped the Dark Spear tribe regain their home and pointed out that the Dark Spear dead belonged in his domain. At one point, when Vol'jin got injured, he noticed that his Shadow Hunter powers were being withheld by the Loa, and in his dreams he was contacted by Bun Samdi. The Death Loa wished Vol'jin would cause as much strife and war as possible due to his influence he had in the Horde in order that more souls would be sent to his domain. When the God King Rastakhan, ruler of the Zandalari Empire, was betrayed by his kin and near death, whom Samdi claimed his soul and refused to give it back. This was due to him being blessed with a very long life by a Loa called Razan, thus Bum Samdi being denied his soul. When Razan was slain by Zul, who was the one that betrayed Rastakhan, the Loa could not keep Bum Samdi at bay any longer regarding the God King. The Loa of Death would eventually declare the blood shows that worshipped Gahun, his enemies, stating that they would be Mahisari. Rastakhan, the God King, would eventually contact Bumsamdi to make a deal with him in order to reclaim his kingdom. For the Loa of Death. Well, this is a surprise. You're looking pretty good, your majesty. So... Why have you come to see me? I need your aid. I see. <laughs> you want to make a deal with me. <laughs> go on, go on. Become my lord. Grant me the power to recover my kingdom, and I will elevate you above all Loa. Yes, yes, so you get your kingdom back, all very nice. But soon you'll tire of old one Samdi. You go back to the living Loa, the one who bring the rain, makes the crops grow, not wither and die. No, 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 I need more than just your word. If you do this for me, I will bind my bloodline to you. All who succeed you will keep this bargain to serve me in life and in death forever. We got a deal. At some point after their deal, Rastakhan's palace would be under attack from Zul, and it is then that Bumsamdi empowered him, as promised, in order to help him reclaim his kingdom. In the end, he managed to kill Zul once and for all. Ooh, look at this! Congratulations, your majesty! The kingdom is ours. Buon Samdi can be found at the necropolis in Nazmir, which is basically where he likes to hang out with adventurers as well as new souls. Anyway guys, this is it on the video, and we hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, be sure to check out our other videos and subscribe. If you're interested in Warcraft, Lord of the Rings slash Hobbit, Pirates of the Caribbean, The Witcher, 
Game of Thrones and other fantasy franchise based lore, stay tuned for more videos like this one. If you're by any chance into LEGO reviews and Star Wars lore videos, check out our main channel, The Scoundrels Cantina. The link for it will be in the description down below. Thank you so much for watching, and remember, no matter how lost you are, the Innkeeper will always show you the path. See you guys in another video.